Mercedes presents the new heavy haulage version of the Actros, the Actros SLT. It's a truck with big ambitions, a robust high-tech vehicle with a pulling weight limit of 250 tons. Georg Staskiewicz from Mercedes says the new SLT is part of the recent revamp of the Actro series. The heavy haulage truck is designed to comply with the Euro 6 emission standards. Meeting those standards meant making some changes to the engine, so Mercedes decided to rethink the entire series. And this is the result. But designing a new heavyweight truck is a complex matter. Andreas Ott from Mercedes explains why. The SLT was designed to handle very large loads, and that required some special steps. A heavy haulage vehicle can't be tested on ordinary roads because they have a 44-ton weight limit. So Mercedes needed a special testing ground to put the truck through its paces. And Mercedes wanted real-life customer feedback. After all, this truck is a working vehicle designed to move heavy goods and construction machinery. Mercedes asked clients in Switzerland and Germany and put their feedback into the new design. That was a key part of the design process. Auch die Rückmeldung von den Kunden zu bekommen, die wiederum bei uns in die Entwicklung eingeflossen sind, das ist ein ganz wichtiger Aspekt in dieser Entwicklung gewesen. Truck driver Hannes Walle gets behind the wheel to check it all out. It's a monster with a 460 kilowatt engine with a torque output of 3000 newton meters. It's all powered by a 15.6-liter V6 engine, but Vala is an old hand, and he knows how to tame the beast. Hannes says the truck does a fantastic job in terms of ergonomics. The layout is the same as in the rest of the new Actros line. The shift lever is positioned on the steering wheel and is easily accessible. The dashboard and instrument layout is excellent. So for the driver, it's just about perfect. The cab is generously proportioned with well over two meters of headroom. Journalist Pierre Kutzner agrees. The first thing you notice is its roominess. There's plenty of room to stand. Materials and workmanship are excellent, too. In a longer layover, spending a few hours in the cab is no problem. It's comfortable, almost homey, and really quite impressive. Das ist einfach beeindruckend. This grill behind the cab hides the cooling tower. It's positioned so that even at low speeds, the truck won't draw in exhaust air. The driver can tilt the cab at the push of a button. The cooling tower stays in position. The 16-speed automatic transmission and the turbo retarder clutch are also technical standouts. Andreas Ott explains that when it comes to heavy haulage trucks, the two challenges are starting up and maneuvering. That means you want a turbo retarder clutch. It fills with oil when you need full power. The fluid can be cooled, which is the real advantage. The heat that's generated is then discharged through the cooling unit. Once the truck is underway, the regular dry clutch comes into action. Then the Actros drives like a regular truck, with a regular transmission. Driver Hannes Walle says you really notice the difference. Starting up a heavy truck like this requires a great deal of power. With the turbo clutch, you can even start the Actros on a slope without rolling backwards. Once the truck is moving, the turbo clutch is switched off. The truck switches to a conventional friction clutch, so there's little slippage. That also helps lower fuel consumption a bit. And once you're on the road, the fully automatic 16-speed transmission makes for a very smooth ride. In both comfort and performance, the Actros SLT is the perfect beast of burden.